and so the options really are to do the Futurama format, which is to simply stay inside your studio and make the movie yourself, which of course keeps it very loyal to the original source material and the fans, because it's the same writers, the same producers, the same uh, voice actors, and it just becomes a very... Um, good solid extension of the original franchise the original canon and law any attempt at actually going to someone else and actually going to a hollywood studio and asking them to make the movie is fraught with such dangers because the entire hollywood mindset is so dangerous to a fun and exciting franchise that is about adventure and craziness and silliness and because fact of the matter is that Hollywood knows how to make lots of money, they know how to make very popular movies, they know how to have lowest, lowest common denominator humour, they know how to do lots of sl silly slapstick, and they know how to uh, make sure that all young kids will enjoy it, they know how to make sure that they can create something that won't alienate anyone, won't anger anyone, won't upset anyone, and they'll just create something that's very cold and empty and useless but it'll become very popular it'll make lots of money and so in the end it'll become a smash hit and it'll become embodied within the very lore of this franchise and so the solution just has to be to tell Hollywood to go away it would be better that this movie does not create, get created which will bring poison and horrible influences into the franchise rather than actually making it. Uh, it. It's better to just leave the franchise alone just as a TV show and not actually make it, make that movie extension of it. And so, wherever you were talking about other, t other TV shows and franchises, such as Rick and Morty, or Adventure Time, or Steven Universe, it would be an absolute disaster if they followed this same format and this same pathway towards uh, humiliation and disaster. They should either not make a movie at all and not allow their franchise to be poisoned by these Hollywoodisms that are, uh, that are break away from the original canon and actually just bring about a whole lot of misinformation and whitewashing and and real dry miserable humor into their franchise or they should make one in studio those are the options just do not contact hollywood hollywood are not your friends uh, they could make a very dry pathetic very funny lowest common denominator movie which will make you a lot of money uh, but in terms of actually creating a work of art that sticks to your franchise, that actually makes it entertaining, that actually holds forth to the characters and the plot, that actually wants to actually create something a wonderful, a wonderful experience that will be remembered forever. There's no way that Hollywood will do that, so the solution is only stick to what you can do to make sure that it's a success. Do not go out there do not contact Hollywood, stick to your in-studio work, and that's the only way that your franchise will not be poisoned like Spongebob and The Simpsons and Garfield have been. Follow the Futurama model.